Bitch, what up, motherfucker? Hey, how you doing, homie? It's your boy, Big Ding Dong Sling Slong, looking at you like a fucking ping pong ball. You look at this thingy, she looks like a ping pong ball. Holy shit. Look, I'm all for body positivity and stuff like that. If I'm not in your best dress, you're fat phobic, bro. You look like a Brussels sprout. I'm sorry, you do. You look like your nan. Well, I remember once I played Henry VIII in school, and my nan made me an outfit, and it looked better than this, and it was made out of a curtain. You know what I mean? And guess how much that cost me? Nada, nothing, free, zilch, zada. She's not my best dress. She looks like a a gnome, a gnome out of Gnomeo and Juliet. She looks like a elf from Lord of the Rings. This is not a good look, bro. This looks like a, you know, a fondue gone wrong. But that's why I'm here. You know, me, best dress every time I go anywhere, big brained every time I do anything. And well, I thought we'd just stalk some people, you know, in a nice way. You know, you know what I mean? Not like Jimmy Savile stalks or Jeffrey Epstein will stalk you. Like, as in stalk people. Okay, let's stop talking. So, la so Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga for outfit changes. She went from pink to black. Notes on fashion. Lady Gaga's funny, isn't she? She looks. She just loves it. She she bloody loves it. She then went pink before you wink. Oh, she's still. Oh my God, she's gone. She's wearing nothing. She's gone to Catwoman mode. Fair dues, Lady Gaga. 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 Fair do. I mean, imagine if you saw that live, you would have been like, "What the fuck's going on?" Rihanna. Dressed as a Simpson with a long ass cape. That, that's pretty cool though. That's like Game of Thrones. I hope they didn't waste that and you know reused it. Sparked millions of memes. <laughs> Look at the memes, bro. She's wearing a spaghetti. She's wearing a pizza. I'll work for food. <laughs> Timmy Charlemagne shooting a shot with Kiki Palmer. Wait a minute, where we met? Uh, Team Vogue. Didn't go very well, clearly. Wait, love you. Bye. Love ya. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't look too happy, did she? Bloody hell, Jack Harlow. Oh, Katy Perry. We gotta go. Dressed as a burger. Bro, see, this is this must be a joke. No way she's dressing up as a cabbage or a piece of lettuce and then jumping inside a bun. You know what I mean? Like, what is she insinuating, bruh? Oh, my. Pete, these people just have too much time, too much money on their hands. <laughs> Hi, J-Lo. And then J-Lo. Who's J-Lo? Is it Jennifer Lawrence? Jennifer Lopez. Walked in the bathroom while Katy Perry is putting on a hamburger. She's cool. Celine Dion kisses Katy Perry, grabs her costume and told that she's hungry. I mean, you must be the biggest dickhead in society to want to wear that and go, I'll tell you what will look really good this year. A nice pretty dash? Oh, a nice big diamond ring. What about a nice tiara? I think I look good as a McDonald's burger. But, you know, like the ones that actually they take pictures of, not the ones that actually come to your table. You know, like, you know, proper. Fuck you. Sarah Paulson's reaction to seeing Madonna at the red carpet. Madonna. That is a dead name. Zendaya's entrance as Cinderella. God, you have to be fucking obsessed with yourself to do shit like this. This is the state of celebrities, boys and girls. Dressing up in things they don't look good at, pretending to be people they're not, and then trying to make, you know, people scream and shout their names. Like, this is traj. This is traj. This is traj. This. What is this? Beyonce? Beyonce? Well, that looks like Beyonce. Well, that's Jay He. Jay Z. Jay Z. Yeah. Okay. Reese Witherspoon. Min I love it when you do it. Say it. Leela Vigny. Cara. Cara. Dale Vane. Dale Vane. Dale Vane is a hard name to say. You can't argue. Time to rewrite her story because the person who actually fell at the Met wasn't Jason Drew. It was Hayden Pin. She fell. Rihanna's bloody having a little giggle at the back. <laughs> oh, girl, you fell. Imagine. she. I remember when she dressed as a cat. It was pathetic. Like, why does she get invited? You know what I mean? I have better chance, more reason to be invited to this shitty thing. Like, what the f... AOC doing this? Tax the rich. I swear you are the rich. Huh? Huh? James Corden having to stand on his tippy toes because he wasn't as tall as his wife. That is truly pathetic. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm a 5'11". All right, take that how you want. I don't know. It's not tall. It's not small. I think it's pretty average. You know what I mean? But I would never do that, bro. If you if your girlfriend's taller, then fucking power to her. Who gives a shit, mate? It means she can reach the top shelf for you. She can do the shopping on her own. <laughs> Sexism. Classic. High five. Well, I'm trying to make him an American right now. Yep. I don't want him to go back to South Korea. <laughs> Where are you from? I'm from London. Oh, from London. So we just getting you for a little while, not for a long while? Yeah, well, we live in LA, so... Oh, yeah. I kidnapped him. I kidnapped him. She doesn't even know who David fucking Beckham is. I mean, you know, 
Brooklyn Beckham. You know what I mean? You can just... It's, it's a disgrace. You don't know who Brooklyn Beckham is. Rita Ora and not Becky Pingala after people allegedly that she was Becky with the good hair. Not Becky. That's that's clever. Kylie Jenner being a third wheel at Blake and Light. I mean, why are there so many glasses? You know? Full black Balenciagas. This is blackface. This is racist. But because it's Kim Kardashian, no one says anything. You know what I mean? Do you think Kanye West would allow this? Do you think your daughters or your kids would allow this? Nada. Racism. Kim Kardashian, Marilyn Monroe, ha happily birthday, Mr. President dress. How dare she even put herself in the same fucking category, never mind the same dress, as the one and only Marilyn Monroe. It's, you know, you look like my big toe compared to her, sweetie. It's all my fault. Oh, crackheads in the bathroom. That's such a sick photo, to be fair. I love that. Let's get the drugs out and inject our last remaining veins. Yeah, so so celebs can smoke in the toilets, but I can't. You're taking the fuck. It's one rule for everyone else, mate. I'm telling you, this just fucking pisses me off. Or, you know, oh, we could do this, we could do that, because we're celebrities. Fuck you. Fuck you. I've had enough. These guys dress like idiots. I review it. Zero out of ten. There is no one who looked good. Chadwick Boseman looks like a king, as always. But the rest of you look like my fucking ball sack when I've not had a shower for ten years.